After dropping them in more than a decade ago, wildlife officials say sturgeon have returned to the Milwaukee River. That's kind of creepy, I have to say, with that <laughs> giant eye right there. Evan Peterson says it is still illegal to fish for them, but experts say they want to know if you see any. If you've been doing some fishing in the Milwaukee River and happen to encounter one of these monsters, Wisconsin Department of Natural Resource officials say it's okay if it took you by surprise. We're starting to see uh, adult and subadult lake sturgeon return to the Milwaukee River. We started stocking them in 2003. We really ramped up the stocking in 2007, 2006 and 2007. Sturgeon are starting to repopulate in the water. And they'll migrate up the river looking for spawning habitat, and that's usually when we see them is when they're in the river. But just because you see them, or even reel one in, doesn't mean they're on the menu. We would like people not to target them. It's illegal to target them, and it's illegal to harvest them. We don't have a, a season set up. The numbers are just too low. These fish can live for over a hundred years, and for the foreseeable future, you can't touch them. If you catch one by accident, you have to release it back. Um, we would like you to, to take pictures while maybe not taking it out of the water. That being said, if you spot one, the DNR would like to hear about it. Simply call them and report what you caught and where. Good to see success and good to see these large fish returning. Um, but it also, you know, we could use a little help watching for them. As any good angler knows, you have to be patient to catch the big one. And these guys could be worth waiting for. In Milwaukee, Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News. To learn more about how to report sturgeon spottings to the DNR, information can be found on our website. Just go to foxsixnow.com.